Now, a few years ago when these used to be what they called the low level trolls, these are not trolls really worth worrying about, but I'm not going to mention no names because to be fair they leave me alone now. But these are what I call low level trolls and basically what happened was they somehow got hold of my number, I don't, well back then, um, and they kept ringing me up and when I was going out with Emma saying shit like about um oh yeah we hear that you do porn shows and and all this lot and we were just playing along with it <laughs> do you honestly think i'm on fucking Pornhub? wow i wish i was i wish i had the money fucking <laughs> absolutely hilarious we just went along with it we know who it was anyway because the phone call was actually traced but it's like i said i didn't even prosecute i didn't need to and they weren't children, they were fully grown adults. Fucking, so we just played along with it. So, and another thing I'd like to emphasise on the fact as well, there was actually a scam going on um, where it comes to um, Emma's um, late boyfriend, one of her late boyfriends. Um, and there was actually, they, they're called honey trap scams. And obviously Paul weren't aware of it until um, fucking he got caught up into one and, and like with the help of Emma and me and other people it, it got sorted out. But what happened was there's a load of these um, what you call desperate women basically and they put photographs out of really good looking women like American women. You know like what American women's wear, their beach clad clothes and all this stuff. Pretend just like Plisco pretends to be somebody that he's not, and basically, um, they go around and they try and get money out of people, so they'll, they'll say all, all sorts of shit just to try and get you to part with your money, and that's all that it was. So, like I said, there was nothing ever untoward. We took it to the police, and the police fucking sorted it all out, and it, it got stopped. But no, like I say, um, when Paul died and that, the phone was left to me. And another thing is I'd like to emphasise on the, on the beautiful fact is, Emma sold Paul's um, tools off, had nothing to do with me whatsoever. She wanted to sell it off because she wanted to make space in her shed, in her garden shed, because to be fair, bless Paul, he, he, loved, it, he loved working out in the shed. Always did. He was a very clever man, very articulate man. He was good with working with his hands. He used to make bird boxes, bat boxes, and all sorts of stuff. He was a very clever man. Um, he spent all his life doing things with wood and nails and hammers and fucking God knows what. But Emma didn't want it cluttering up the, the, the shed anymore. So she wanted to, to, to get rid of it all. She had no use for it. So she went to cash converters. So, um, like I say, Plisco, you've been reported to the police. Carry on spouting your lies, okay? Because if you want to... I'm, I'm going to put the fucking habardinkum in this one now. Carry on doing what you're doing, Plisco. And it won't just be me that's also making statements against you. You will have another witness making things against you statements i promise you this one so i suggest you to the loo get a life go and watch some tv go fishing or do something yeah because i'm telling you now i'm not fucking about no more fuck off you fucking weirdo i've told the police they are actually watching your stream now and if you think i'm joking here we go I'll show you the fucking number. There you go. 
That's all I'm going to show. But there you go. There's part of the number. There you go. I ain't fucking about. I've just called them. And I've just told them. So carry on with your lies. And your vindictiveness. Because like I say. Oh. And I'll show you something else as well that I've done. I've now just sent your live stream direct to the police as well. To the fucking crime bureaus department. And to the fucking cyber crime unit. So there you go. Shove that. You fucking weirdo. Bow your fucking life you sad cunt. So you want to think I'm joking. Try me on that one. You fucking weirdo. You will fuck off and leave me alone. You fucking sad nonce. You're a fucking nonce. Going around ringing up random people's schools in their area and shit like that. You're a fucking nonce. Fucking weirdo. You're the fucking nonce. Fucking weirdo. What, did you get bummed in the arse as a kid or something? You must have done. Because you're one fucked up, sick little bastard. And I will fucking get you to leave me alone. You fucking little bastard. Now fuck off. You fucking weird cunt. You fucking dirty little scumbag. You're a fucking weirdo. Get a life, you fucking smack rat. Sick of you. You fucking scourge on society. Now fuck off. You fucking weirdo. Absolute fucking weirdo. And you muppets that hang around with him, you think it's clever. You're all a fucking bunch of weirdos. What you do, sucking Plisco off like that, are ya? You must be. You're that fucking sad and desperate and lonely. Fucking weirdos. Get a fucking life, you sad cunts. Get a sad fucking life, man. Go and get a life, you fraggles. You bunch of fucking weirdos. Weirdos, man. Get a fucking life. You sad fucking cunt. Man, you are seriously sick puppy that needs putting down. And you will get put down, I promise you. You will get put down. Legally. You fucking sad cunt. Fucking horrible bastard. I tell you, you're going to pay for what you're doing to me. I promise you. You're going to fucking pay dearly. You fucking weirdo. You sick puppy, mate. You should have been put down in a fucking bucket at first at birth. Your mother should have kept the fucking afterbirth instead. Should have got more fucking intelligence and proudness out of it. Fucking, I'll tell you what, if you was my fucking brother, I would have fucking killed you by now. Fucking weirdo. Absolute fucking weirdo. Fucking nonce. Fucking weirdo. And do you know the ironic thing about it is to all the weirdos that are on his live stream? I don't know if he's watching me still. I don't know and I don't care. But do you know what's really funny? He calls me a nonce, yeah? But this is, you're hanging around with a guy that likes to pretend to be a child and go up onto all these fucking playrooms pretending to be a child. Which there's plenty of videos of it out there because people have got it. Because I've got a recording of it. And the police have got it. And my slizzers have got it. Fucking weirdo. Fucking, so who's the fucking nonce? Fucking weirdo.
Who's the fucking weirdo? Fucking nonce. You're the fucking nonce. And for all those fucking idiots that want to hang around with fucking Plisco, what you sort of don't realise is, I already had all my stuff taken off me years ago, and it all come back clean. All come back clean. And I will have all my stuff back again. Or, in fact, it's already ready to come back. I'm just waiting for it now. All clean. As you sort of fucking stupid mugs for believing every bit of shit that comes out of this fucking weird Scottish guy's mouth. He's a fraggle. He's a nonce. And you that hang around with a nonce. Pedophile. Fucking weirdo. And he hasn't just done it to me, he's done it to Jupiter. He's done it to fucking Moon. He's done it to all of them. That's what he does, he's a fucking sick Puppy mate, that's about to get put down. Fucking weirdo. Absolute fucking weirdo. Absolute fucking weirdo. But he's a, and he fucking knows it. This Scots guy knows what's coming his way. And he's fucking shitting himself. That's why now he's trying to make discredit everybody else. Because he fucking knows he's done a wronging. He's a proper fucking wronging. And you muppets that hang around with him, you're going to go down with him, I promise you. Fucking weirdos. Fucking weirdos. So all you lot that are fucking hanging around with him, don't fucking moan about it when you get caught, because it'll be guilty by association, and the police have already said that. So carry on, I don't really give a flying fuck anymore. Your days are numbered. You want to hang around with a fucking nonce like Plisco? Carry on, bruh. See, this is what Plisco don't realise, the crimes that he's committed. He ain't told you that, has he? No. All the fucking innocent people's towns he's been ringing up and all that because he sits on his ass behind a PC because he's bored. He's got no fucking life. He's a lonely, fucking sad old man, incel. He's got nothing. He's an absolute zilch. He sits there going like that over me all day. The guy's obsessed with me. Fucking fruit bar. Please go. You're going down. You're a weirdo. Fuck off. Fucking nonce. You're a fucking absolute nonce. Fucking weirdo. Fuck off. Stupid cunt. And you fucking silly fucktards that hang around with him, you'll go down with him. Guilty by association. You fucking numpties. Fucking idiots. You ain't got the fucking brains you were born with. Fucking idiots. Fucking stupid cunts. They just don't realise how fucking stupid and how fucking idiots they are. They've got themselves sucked into some fucking idiot. Because he's a sad little fucktard. Fucking mongo.
He's got nothing else fucking better to do. Fucking weirdo. Don't get a life, you stupid cunt. Sad little twat. Sad little prick. You will not be trolling me for much longer, I promise you. And you will leave me alone. It is the last fucking thing I do. Fucking weirdo. Don't get a life. Sad cunt. What an absolute fucking weirdo. Tell you what, man, when I find out who you are, I'm, the first thing I'm going to get my solicitor to order in that courtroom is a fucking psychiatric evaluation done on you. I promise you. Because I tell you what, you ain't no normal person, mate. You've come out of a fucking mental hospital, mate. You are seriously fucked up in the head, bro. That's the first thing I'm going to do. You seriously need fucking locking up and fucking banging on the head, mate, I tell you. You seriously need it. You fucking weirdo. You need fucking psychiatric help, bro. Fucking weirdo. Absolute fucking weirdo. Even the police down here have said you're fucking psychiatrically sick. You are one fucking weirdo, bruh. One fucking weirdo. You need fucking help. You don't need prison. You need sectioning. For the rest of your natural life. You fucking pleb.